guys, hold up, hold up. So we got a brand new laser gun in Modern Warfare 2, and this is probably the most futuristic weapon in this game. It's a brand new bundle called Tracer Pack Shinobi. It has blue tracer, so it looks like you're shooting out a laser, and then also the death effect is insane. It's really cool because this gun obviously has a laser just coming out of it, and it actually has its own unique laser. It's basically a shuriken. I just love, like, the blue aura just coming out of, like, this gun. I can't show you guys the death effect, like, in the firing range, but once you guys see it, you're gonna be like, what the hell? Before we jump into today's video, I'm only giving you guys five seconds to drop a like. If you guys don't drop a like, you fail the mission and you get bad luck. I wouldn't risk it. Shipment is probably gonna be the best map to show off this, like, tracer and this death effect. Oh my, okay. Look at that. Look at that. Yes. All right. So you see, like, a slash. I'm getting absolutely spawn trapped right now, which is so fun. Thank you. Yeah, you guys see that slash? I think that's really sick, to be honest. Probably one of the coolest, like, death effects in this game right now. These spawns make no sense. These spawns don't make any sense. What the? These people are just spawning in front of me. What the? What the? What the? Oh, my God. This gun is a literal laser. What the? Get away from me, bro. Oh, my God. I got him. I got him. Yo, this thing runs out of ammo too fast. This thing runs out. He was shooting my body. Man. Oh my gosh, bro. Dude, these spawns are insane. Yo, that guy's mic is awful. Walking camper. My teammate just got a triple kill with that. No way. Got the advance. Shoot the fucking These spawns, man. It's just the spawns on this map are now so bad for some reason. I just genuinely don't get it. Secure Bravo. Hostile Overwatch Hilo in the area. The enemy holds two objectives. Wait, they have an Overwatch Hilo? No way. How do these how do they have an Overwatch Hilo? How do these guys have an Overwatch Hilo? Guys, I don't understand. Laying in the crate. How do these guys have an Overwatch Hilo? I don't get it, man. I'm so screwed. I'm so screwed. I'm so screwed. I knew it! I'm taking fire! Planting mine! Got the helo. Definitely needed that helo. We gotta be careful here now. Watch your fire, eh? 
Wait. Oh, I'm getting the overhead. Got the advanced UAV. Wait. Our UAV is orbit in the area. Contact. Taking the lead. Bro, UAV we were on such a nice streak. I don't even know what we were on. Is that real, bro? Bro, that death effect is just so sick, though, man. Oh, my gosh. It's like a beam of light sometimes. I don't get it. Yeah, that beam of light is crazy. Got an Overwatch, Hilo? Let's go. We control two objectives. I'm reloading. Oh my god, I'm turning up. Got the advance. Copy the advance UAV is entering enemy station Bravo. Hostile acquired. There's someone with a riot shield in there. We lost our overwatch helo. Someone with a riot shield is being really weird. On a ruthless. Let's go. Let's go. Reloading. I'm trying to pop off as much as I can. Friendly cruise missile approaching target. Let's get this munitions box. There's people back here. What the? How did I die? There's no kill cam. I can't even see how I die. I just really hope with season two, they just start releasing a lot more, I don't know, better bundles because the ones in season one were just so bad. I'm really hoping with season two, they start to turn up maybe with like, you know, reactives or master crafts or, you know, whatever, man. I just want to see, I just want to see some more stuff. I'd love to see master crafts come back in Modern Warfare 2, man. I just think the game needs it really. Like that is one of the coolest things when it comes to Call of Duty. And I think Vanguard and Black Ops Cold War really did it well, man. I really think they did it well. Yeah, they release some really bad bundles sometimes. And I'm just like, how? Like, why? who is buying this? Like, who is genuinely buying this stuff. I just, I literally don't get it. This guy's just in the corner. I'm gonna shoot your body because you're playing like a weirdo. That's crazy because I literally stopped shooting that dude. That's funny. Wow. Holy crap. Confirm that one. Setting mine! Overwatching low range to deploy. Changing max. Have visual on a target. UAV is bingo fuel. Enemy down! I'm hit! Advanced UAV standing by. Need recon overhead grenade! Tag secure, kill confirmed. I need air support now! Vandal 310 down. If I would have died to that nade, I would have been so pissed, bro. <laughs> I would have been so upset. All right, this is where we got to be careful. I don't like that. I don't like that. Visual on a target. Scratch one. 
Bro, this game has been insane. Bro, I feel like this advance lasts for like 18 minutes. Oh my god, no shot you're behind there. I'm on a brutal. Sniper's down. Ready for deployment. Tactical kill confirmed. Oh my god, bro. I I had no idea where to go. Oh my gosh, I had no idea where to go, man. Let's go, man. Oh my god. The games today, the games that I had today were so stressful. Between the shipment games, the, the game that I just died on, on Dome, I was just, I was losing it, bro. I was genuinely losing it today. There you go. There we go. The new laser gun, fellas. This was the class setup that I was rocking on this laser gun. For the bow, we have the 10.5 Bruin Typhon, which gives you sound suppression, hip fire accuracy, bullet velocity, and damage range. This whole entire class setup, basically, Basically helps out with like hip recoil control and like hip fire accuracy so we're gonna do aim walking speed as well as damage range right there for the laser we have of course the canted laser which comes with this variant it's like a unique laser only for this gun basically and obviously you get aiming stability aim down sight speed uh sprint to fire speed stuff like that oh, i forgot you could actually tune the lasers okay so i'd probably do it for like sprint to fire speed and probably like aim down sight speed that's probably what i would tune the laser for the stock we have the bruin flash v4 which gives you more sprint to fire speed aim walking speed ads speed stuff like that we're going to tune it for ads speed and aim walking speed we got the 50 round magazine which helps out this gun a lot and then for the underbrow we have the uh back draft grip which gives you more hip fire accuracy hip recoil control stuff like that and we're going to do hip recoil control and hip fire accuracy honestly the look of this gun and the death effect and the tracers and everything like that everything about this gun is really really cool and i just hope that modern warfare 2 continues to progress forward and add more cool variants and more blueprints and bundles bundles have been so bad like i said so hopefully they go in this direction thank you all so much for watching have a great day i will see you next time